see our friends from uh, uh, the other side. They pushed their way into government using the handshake. They took over committees in parliament. They took over the running of government. Three years down the line, because they have failed miserably, they now want to run away from their own failure. They are now trying to say, Jubilee has not done this, Jubilee has not done this. Which, which Jubilee are you talking about? You know, three years ago, you took over the whole place. Now, please, you must carry your failure with you. You came, you changed the priorities of, uh, of our government. You told us the big four was not a priority. Uh, the running and the programs we had, the universal health coverage was not a priority to you. Housing was not a priority to you. The whole program of manufacturing was not a priority to you. You told us you had alternative priorities in the BBI. We have been at it for the last three years. So you cannot turn around today and want to escape or run away from the failures that you have caused this administration and start to point fingers to this administration that is run by the president. Please, have some decency. You know, be, 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 be gentlemen and accept that you have caused the country monumental failure by virtue of overturning the priorities that we have and you will squarely have to carry the consequences of what has happened to us the last three years. It is obvious, every Kenyan knows. This government was running, this government was delivering, until the time we were told the priorities must change. Until the time we were told committees in parliament must change. And, and so how can the same people who changed our priorities, changed committees in parliament, took over the running of uh, uh, many sectors of his administration, how can they turn back today and start to try and point fingers?